a greying day here in Hertfordshire. Scene set, game that couldn't mean have different effects for both teams as the ball's fired forward from Mantum early, looking to test Josh Pasty, the right back. He sees it back to Ross Warner, who's playing in the Hawks goal to the right-hand side of us in an unusual light green goalkeeper kit today. Haven't seen that debuted from Ross Warner yet this season, almost always in the navy blue, but today he's in a highlighted green shirt. Joe Newton will drive forward from left back, picking up the loose ball. Still going is the young fullback for the Hawks. He'll whip in across towards the near post, headed away. Oh, as far as McCarthy, blocked in front of goal well by Dominic Morgan Griffiths. Rooney side foots one out to Billy Clifford. Brilliant start for the Hawks. Can they keep this up? Out to Jake McCarthy again, but cleared away by Mantum, 18 yards from goal. Hawks with a little bit of space here in the final third, but they're being forced backwards by good pressure from Scott Morris. And Newton's got it in the left back position. Nowhere for Newton to go. Looping one over the top to Roberts. Headed down to Tommy Wright. 18 yards from goal. Right on his right boot. Lining up a shot well blocked in front of goal by Nemhard. Out only as far as Duku saved by King. Good defending initially by Joe Ash Nemhard to slide in front of Billy Clifford and force that ball away from goal. Headed forward again by Fassenmaids. Schroll. Recycles possession through the back line with Ross Warner. Hamilton Waterlooville just slowing things down here. Schroll curling into the corner where Ajayi's picked it up. Ajayi will fire forward to Fassenmade. Run through to Charlie Hughes. Flag stayed down. Hughes, 1-1 one -one with Warner. Surely it's going to be 1-0. Brilliant save, Warner. Cleared away at the second attempt by Troll. Paul Rooney slips in front of goal. Free kick, Hawks. How is it not 1-0 to Hamill Hempstead? Charlie Hughes ran 1-1 one -on -one with Ross Warner. Drove towards goal. Warner spread himself well and denied Charlie Hughes his ninth goal of the season. Only lost one of their last four at home and that was to League winners now Maidstone who sealed the title on Saturday James Roberts with the ball in the centre circle out to Manny Duke it goes right wing overlapping run from Josh Pasty. Hawks have a man over on that right hand side Pasty crosses towards Tommy Wright bounces awkwardly in front of Westbrook who deals with it well but the Hawks have won it back Duku 20 yards from goal left footed effort curled past the post had Craig King wandering for a moment he's already scored directly from a corner kick against Oxford City earlier on this season he looks hungry here. Billy Clifford in swinging right boot. Curled towards the back post. He went for it and it was flicked away at that back post for a Hawks corner kick on the far right hand side. All waiting in the area. Right arm goes up in the air. Rolled across the near post. It's one for the training ground. Rolled back to James Roberts. He strikes towards goal. Blocked in front of goal by Charlie Hughes, the striker. Now a counter attack being led from Hemel Hempstead. Josh Pasley loops one back over the top of the back line and straight out of play for a Craig King goal kick. Thank you for all your comments at half time or at the end of the first half. And a lot of people wishing a Joe Newton goal today. Hasn't scored yet this season as he crosses one towards the back post and Manny Duku. Duku heads down into the side netting. Never really on from the angle. Tried to win the ball. Head it back to where it came from across the goal but well wide in the end even if it did catch the side netting before it went behind the goal. It's showing exactly his class that he brings now. He's since joining the squad, really, and be able to not only able to clear it, but able to distribute well as well. Rooney slid into Manny Duku in the area, one on one with King on his right foot, saved by King and past the post. Really shouldn't have given King a chance. Great ball from Paul Rooney to slide it into Manny Duku. First touch wasn't the best, but he still had room for the shot inside the 18 yard box, but rolled it into the legs of Craig King, who deflected it past the post. Corner kick, Haven't and Waterlooville, left-hand side. They go short to James Roberts on the edge of the area. Roberts back to Clifford. Will whip it back out to James Roberts on that left wing. Roberts curling effort towards King. What a save, Craig King. Roberts tested him from James Roberts' territory. The left half space, curling one under the bar. So similar to his goal against Welling. But King leans back and gets a palm over. Pasley sends forward to McCarthy. Suffers it with his first touch. Tries to roll into Manny Duku. Great, crucial touch in there from Carla Jai. Newton finds Roberts now on the right wing to Duku, back to Roberts in the area, crossed across the six-yard box, drops to Tommy Wright, spins, shoots, blocked on the line by Craig King. You thought for one moment that was just going to bounce agonisingly over Craig King's legs, but he's able to scramble it away from his own six-yard box and the ball safely in the Tudors goalkeeper's hand. Dead centre, thinking about a shot, instead just checks his run slightly. Hughes, first time to Morgan Griffiths, 20 yards from goal. Clifford trying to force him backwards. Rooney's in there helping him. Still, they can't take it off him. Morgan Griffiths, shot from range. Saved by Warner down to his right. But nervy moments again for the Hawks. Sent back to Paul again. Curled one with the outside of his boot into the area towards Nemhard. Hawks clear away at the second attempt. Morgan Griffiths fires over the top. Pasley has to head away. Having a Waterlooville can't break out of their own back line right now. Mantum to 
Fasten made, chipped into Cerulli, left footed strike goes over the bar and just wide. So King with the ball in his hands. As Chippenham now we have, we now have confirmation, our two up. Sent forward to Tommy Wright, he's in a foot race with Nemhard. He gets there first, but it runs through to Craig King. Looking down the line for Andrews, pinched by Fassenmaid. He's round Rooney on his right boot, looking for a shot. Warner saves. Wasn't the best hit effort in the world from Fassenmaid, but it had Warner wandering. Say that in a hurry. Warner sends it into the sky, but that will be that. Both sides had chances to win it. Neither were able to take them. In the end, probably a fair result on the balance of play, and it sets up a fantastic showdown next week with Sir Albans losing. It's winner takes all between the Bluebirds and the Hawks to get that final playoff spot at the Draper Tools Community Stadium.